Hello everybody and welcome back to Bring Your Own Popcorn. So, today I thought I would uh, do something a little bit different for you guys. Um, behind this door is actually um, my low budget home cinema room. Um, my mum and dad built that when I was in primary school. Um, this whole wall never actually used to be here. Um, it's, been, it's been built in the attic and um, this door was never here, this has all been added in. Um, and I thought I would take you guys on a little tour of my cinema room, so let's go. So if we start down here, um, this is my DVD, Blu-ray, physical media collection. Um, I've been collecting for a good number of years. Um, basically every Christmas, every birthday, every bit of pocket money I get all goes to DVDs. It is a big hobby of mine, collecting. Uh, these shelves I think actually are bathroom shelves and um, but we've managed to modify them um, and just extend them up for when I need um, more space because I'm always adding to the collection. Um, uh, link in the description if you want to um, see these shelves and we'll head up the stairs. Okay, so we've got more of my um, collection up here. Um, I've got my Disney stuff here, my Marvel stuff and my Steelbook stuff. Um, these are shelves from Argos. These are actually um, bookshelves. Um, I put a link down in the description uh, for everything I talk about. Um, we've got my projector here. Um, this is a BenQ projector. Um, I'll work out the uh, model number later and put a link down in the description for it. Um, but this projector's never been changed or anything. This is the same projector um, that we started out with. Um, it's sort of served as well. Um, down here, we've got my record player because I also collect um, records. Um, I got this for, I think, my Christmas 2020, I want to say. Um, or it might have been 2019. Um, it's a really cool record player. It looks like a, a car stereo, an old car stereo. Um, Really cool. I'll put a link down in the description for that. This is, this is my um, Xbox Series X. Um, that's what I use to play Blu-rays on, DVDs, what I use to game on. Um, again, link down in the description for that. Really good Xbox. Um, basically does everything. Um, around the room we've got our surround sound system. Um, and that actually goes through the Blu-ray player that we've got down here goes through and connects up to the surround sound system. Um, I down there, ignore that uh, bit of the wall guys by the way, We've, um, we tried to put something up there and then we didn't like it, we took it down and basically some of the, the paint came away with it. Um, got a couch here, just a table, cheap Argos table, another chair there with a, um, a stool to put your feet on. So down here, um, we've got our Panasonic surround sound system. Um, that goes up to the uh, BenQ projector, the short throw projector. Uh, we had to get a short throw projector just simply because of the size of the room. Um, it, it's not big enough to have a long projector, so we needed to get one that would just project from where we basically could put the projector. The quality of the projector is um, 780p. Um, the screen is a fixed 90 inch screen. Um, it's not one to move, it's fixed on the wall. You don't actually get the full effect of the screen um, until I turn the lights off and crank up the volume. So that's what I'm going to do for you now. So I'm just going to hit the light switch and crank up the volume for you so you can hear the surround sound. <laughs> Be sure it speaks 
I've had this room, as I said, since I was very young, since I was in primary school, um, and it really has changed my life. It's really gave me such a passion for film. I actually study um, film at college now, and it's something I want to do as a career. Um, so this low budget um, cinema room has actually shaped my career path and what I want to do with my life. We done a quick um, calculation um, and excluding the DVD collection itself, um, we think we got this we got this room done for probably around just under five grand. Um, but please bear in mind that's with a lot of um, budget equipment, uh, second hand equipment and a lot of hard work. Um, but we think we got this um, room done for around uh, five grand. Uh, and the last thing I would like to show you is a local um, sign company made this for me. It's my Star Wars mural and it's just up there um, on the ceiling. How cool is that? So guys, I hope you enjoyed um, this little tour of my homemade low budget cinema room. If you enjoyed it, I would really appreciate you like the video, comment, subscribe, all that jazz, and I shall see you in the next video. Goodbye.